influence of the late anti-apartheid struggle stalwart Dilo Omar in developing South Africa's democracy continues to be felt long after his passing in 2004. That's the message from Higher Education Minister Naledi Pando. She delivered the keynote address at the annual Dula Omar lecture at the University of the Western Cape last, ne- last night. Namawetu Sawandle reports. Dala Omar, remembered for his work to promote human rights and develop South Africa's democracy. His colleagues described Omar as someone who served the ANC and the country well. Delivering the keynote address at the Dala Omar annual memorial lecture, Higher Education Minister Naledi Pandor lambasted recent commentary from writers and analysts whom she described as having a very sanitized view of South Africa's history trying to minimize the immense contributions of leaders such as former President Mandela and his first cabinet. We should always recall the contribution uh, that he made uh, in the uh, struggle for freedom in South Africa. And then not only that, his uh, role in really laying the foundation and framework for our democracy, particularly in the justice sector, and often we forget in transport uh, as well. Very committed to human rights, uh, really engaged uh, with the judiciary in attempting to transform the legal and judicial uh, profession in our country. One of the things that we learned from him is that you cannot conceive of yourself as an excellent institution if there is no diversity in, in your institution. And he taught us to reject the idea uh, that uh, transformation is always at the expense of quality. Fourteen years after Omar's death, his family says he needs to be remembered for the role he played in liberating South Africa. It's a sign of great honor that, uh, that he is being remembered and his contribution and it... Uh, principles and beliefs on which he built his life and influenced all of us too, by the way, um, is being remembered, upheld and spread by lectures such as these. Omar's aim was always to try and unite people. Pando stressed the need for the country to continue with the work started by struggle activists like him. Nomao Tusolwandle, SABC News, Cape Town.